We've been hearing all week from people with dreams about what the next era of humanity is going to be. And now, arguably, the biggest visionary of them all, Elon Musk. He seems to be like a guy that if you had a movie character and the movie character was this like super billionaire and he yeah. was really genuinely working to save humanity. This building is the, the most advanced car factory that Earth has ever seen. That's why everyone is so excited that Elon Musk is trying to buy Twitter. A few hours ago, you made an offer to buy Twitter. Why? How'd you know? <laughs> oh, it's happening, people! Elon Musk is offering to buy Twitter, all of the shares he does not currently own, for $43.4 billion in cash. He also says he wants to take the company private. Musk writing a letter to Twitter chair Brett Taylor saying, quote, Twitter has extraordinary potential. I will unlock it. And I'm not sure that I will actually be able to, to acquire it. Breaking news right now. Elon Musk is buying Twitter. After weeks of uncertainty, Elon Musk struck a deal to buy Twitter at a price of roughly 44 billion bucks. But the question is, what's he going to do with it? Elon Musk says he is buying Twitter to save free speech online. A white knight has appeared. Twitter has become kind of the de facto town square. It's just really important that people have the both the, uh, the reality and the perception uh, that they are able to speak freely within the bounds of the law. You know, so uh, one of the things that I believe Twitter should do is open source the algorithm. He wants to make the algorithm more transparent so we know why things are trending or why tweets go places. I like that, right? And he wants to get rid of bots and scams, which I love. You know, the idea that he's also now going to be essentially the referee of major political speech around the world, all of that is definitely way outside what Elon Musk has ever done before. One of the biggest social media companies in the world will only be accountable to that one guy and what he considers free speech. If liberals are upset with Twitter now that Musk owns it, they can form their own platform that has more censorship. My strong intuitive sense is that uh, having a public platform that is maximally trusted um, and, 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 and broadly inclusive is extremely important to the future of civilization. Thanks for watching our program. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and even subscribe.